analysis and troubleshooting of analog and digital systems, field service equipment repair, quality control and inspection, cable installation, alarm system installation and maintenance, home theater automation, and so much more. We have a robot arm that has the base can swivel. I'm teaching flow charting right now so that the, uh, so a machine can follow the flow. Meet Darnell Smith, one of the electronics engineering technology instructors at YTI Career Institute. He's also one of the first graduates of this very program when it first started. I mean, I went to an electronic company right away. I went straight into R&D, uh, into uh, HVAC. Then Darnell decided he wanted to give back and teach students the electronics trade. In the last term, we have automated controls, which is everything the manufacturer requires. And that's what they're getting by the time they get out the door. And getting out the door can happen for these students in as few as 20 months. Graduates leave with an associate's degree in specialized technology. Lecture is online with industry modeled labs on campus. So, I mean, they're right out the door making money, more money than I've ever even heard of. So I think the trades are all coming back right now. We need to be able to produce here in our own country. See it there? Yeah. Right next door in the industry model labs at YTI is where we find Thomas Farrell, program director for the Electronics Engineering Technology Department. These are six term students. They're getting ready to start that journey out into the field. This is where students will be able to apply their online instruction and hands-on training via their externship. The biggest one in the area has um, been by far Letterkenny. Uh, over the years, they have taken almost 100 of our students. Johnson Control is another big uh, employer. BAE Systems, Northrop Grumman, Exelon Energy. So a lot of big companies, a lot of smaller companies too. Many of these externships result in full-time employment. There has been um, a young lady that went to Boeing. Uh, she actually works on F-16 fighter jets. If you or someone you know would like more information on this program or any of the programs offered at YTI Career Institute, please go to yti.edu.